I'm all about getting done with this. <laughs> hey guys, we're the Holderness family and we are amazing at crafts. Are we? <laughs> I would have to go all the way back to there. Oh! oh. So um, this one's interesting because my wife is a little bit picky with what kinds of rugs she brings into the home. I've actually picked some out and brought them home and she has sent them uh, back. Yes. So I can't believe we're about to make our own rug. We are gonna make a DIY pom-pom rug. About a thousand of you have asked that we try this. It says it's simple um, and I thought it'd be cool to do one like in a heart shape for Valentine's Day. Oh wow. That's a terrible idea. Here's what you need, a rug pad some yarn, Ow. some scissors. We need a toilet paper rolls, like a couple like toilet paper, empty toilet paper holder, <laughs> cardboard thing. Well, I always throw away my toilet paper rolls now because somebody got really upset when I wasn't changing the toilet paper rolls. <laughs> it's day six and no one in my family has refilled the toilet paper holder. Maybe okay, so we're gonna make it in a heart shape. So uh, so let's get our rug pad out, and then we're gonna cut it into the shape of a heart. Okay, I think that's good. Here we go. Three, two, one. Perfect. Oh. So now we're gonna take two toilet paper rolls. We're going to wrap the yarn 90 times. Why 90? 90 times? Not sure, but that's what the internet says, and I trust everything that I've ever seen on the internet. So I think this is like 90 ish. Ready? I've wrapped mine about 50 11 times right now. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I'm at 61 right now, which is 50 11. Okay, so I'm gonna slide this off. I'm gonna cut it. Hold it kind of like this. Now take your string. Cut another piece of string, and in the middle, yes, Yay! in the middle. Oh, I, oh, I understand. Wait a then second. you, oh. and then you cinch it in the middle like that. Not. You did it. Now tie it really tight, right. tightly, and then you take oh. these and you cut like this. Oh, okay. So that's going to be tricky. I like to see some of these are sp are flayed out. I, I, yeah, I know where the middle. Is. Oh, that's how the shag happens. Yeah. So <coughs> now with these little ties. Push it through. And you tie it in. And you tie it on. So this is gonna be a fairly fluffy carpet. Yes. Wait, that is actually a little more bushier than I was expecting. Yeah. That is um, 1970s carpeting, Daddy, if you know what I mean. Daddy, um, I'll do <laughs> I think this is too puffy, so let's do No, go full book. I mean go full um 90. go full with that. Go. I feel like that those are gonna look kinda weird. Okay, so do 50. And I've just decided to use my hands and make them nice and wide. And it's like the result is not terrible. That's right. That's it right there. And that's about what we want, right? Mm hmm. I'm all about getting done with this. Okay. I mean, you could have gone Target and gotten one, but you know, we're just going to make one. Very more expensive. At <laughs> home. Oh. That is a good point. Is this going to end up being more expensive than actually buying a ride? But, you guys, if we just gone to Target, we wouldn't be here. We wouldn't be buying. here together complaining about things. I think I'm prepared to say this is the most torturous craft we've ever done. Yeah. Wait a minute, let's go back on this. You did do bath bombs. This is a disaster. But that was fast and terrible. This is slow How long did it take to clean up that thing? That is true, it took like two hours. I think the problem is all of the pom-poms are now of different sizes. So you guys might notice there's a random woman in a beanie behind me. I feel like I should mention that that's our niece, Bianca. And she's that's helping our... us with captions on one of our Facebook videos. Bianca, come over and help us. We brought in a millennial to help us. Anytime a craft does like a, a fast forward. It means it takes forever. It's it they beware. Go to Target. Just beware. Forgot to just like that. So just <laughs> random spaghetti. <laughs> you will clean up. I'm spinning the yarn. No, Nothing rhymes farm. with yarn except for barn and flarn. <laughs> He's bailing. I only made like one. Lola is yawning and dropping no, no, things no, on the ground. I don't have scissors because I'm raising the scissors. So Use the scissors. scissors. I don't need scissors. I'm getting too old for this craft. <laughs> you are. There is craft all over this kitchen. 
<laughs> Our kitchen is full of craft right now. We are all so full of craft. <laughs> I've never been this full of craft in my entire life. You are, you, these are I am the king of crap. <laughs> Hold on. So now we've made all of our palms. Um, we've discovered that you don't actually need a toilet paper roll if you are very careful on your hand. Thanks, Pen. And now begins the fun part of tying them all to the mat. Wait, are you kidding me? We've started ignoring our children and they're now raising themselves. That pizza, I'm pretty sure stayed out overnight. Yep. So, cool. Um, I don't really okay, well. You're um, ready for college. Cheese is mostly bacteria anyway. Okay. This is a testament to our love for you, the people who we also love. And I love you, honey. And this will be somewhere in our house. <laughs> I think it looks good. Let's put it on the ground like a real rug. Ready? So it's like, oh, we're cooking, and there's a rug. There's. And that looks good. It does. I mean, not really good, but <laughs> it looks kind of good. I mean, we finished! Thanks for watching. Yeah. What other terrible, terrible things should we try? Because this was awful. Yeah, oh, and just a quick look around. Like, there's the crap, and there's what we have to clean up. Yeah. Looks like someone threw yard. All over the Yeah. Well. Toilet paper and everything. Oh, and by the way, now all of our toilet paper rolls are flimsy. And you, um, you know. Oh, and you're stepping. Pretty, I don't think you could step on the rug. It's a rug. What you I mean? Step you can't on step it. on it.